The mountain team at Arctic Cat's been working hard on their mountain snowmobiles. Last year they introduced us to the Mountain Cat chassis, which incorporated a rolled and lengthened out chain case and narrow running boards. These changes took a very good mountain climbing snowmobile and turned it into a very phenomenal mountain climber. What's in front of me is the 2018 Mountain Cat. For 2018, we have an all new motor in this snowmobile, the 800cc SeaTech. This is a direct injection motor with three stage exhaust valves, which boasts more bottom horsepower, more bottom end torque, mid range. Also, on the 2018, we have a host of lightweight parts a new gas tank which is actually stronger and lighter than the previous one. We have lightweight track drivers and a lightweight brake. Also we have a new roller clutch. All of these these improvements to this snowmobile has taken off 15 pounds from the previous model. So rider impressions on this new machine and I failed to mention that we also got a whole new look on this 2018 Mountain Cat much narrower side panels. This is important because these side panels help when you're side hilling, they won't push you out on the snow. The term that's been coined is called paneling out. And we found that this new design plastic just really holds on to the side hill very well. Another premium feature on this Mountain Cat is uh, in the, the rear skid, you have very premium shocks on this. They uh, have three settings on it. The first setting would be kind of a soft trails type of setting. The second setting would be set up for more aggressive type riding. But the third setting is a unique feature on this Mountain Cat. It's actually called a lockout setting, which means that if you're in the deep snow and you're climbing hills and stuff and you don't want any over transfer, you can actually lock out the rear skid. Now I know my first question was, well, what if you hit something big and you need your suspension? Yes, it'll work then. But this lockout feature works very well. It just keeps the snowmobile flat. It keeps that track down in the snow and it just keeps digging. Overall rider impressions, this new motor is definitely for real. It starts good. The power band on it, especially through the bottom end and the mid range is just phenomenal. Uh, Arctic Cat tells us that you get better fuel economy, there's less oil being used on it. It uh, works very well. It's very similar to sound and feel as the previous engine, but a uh, little lighter engine, a little more horsepower, uh, cleaner burning. They've definitely got a good motor in this. The roller clutch, uh, without any question, your first time you uh, engage it, you can tell how smooth and precise it is and the belt life and the, the belts running uh, much cooler are going to be greatly improved by this new roller clutch. Uh, the overall handling of this uh, new Mountain Cat is just, it's just been a pleasure to ride in the deep snow. Uh, what's in front of me is the three inch power claw track, the 162. It's been a good track for a lot of years. It works, it works just phenomenal in the deep snow. If you're in the market uh, for a new mountain snowmobile, take your time to go to your Arctic Cat dealer and take a look at this uh, new Mountain Cat. It works very well. The durability of this chassis has been very proven. It works well in the deep snow. It climbs very good. So whatever your brand loyalty is, whatever you're currently riding, if you're in the market for a new snowmobile, Take the time uh, to take a look at this uh, new Arctic Cat, it's a good one.